the heat pump revolution. Until recently, there were huge segments of America where the winter weather simply made using an electric heat pump impossible, instead requiring gas or propane furnaces for those days and nights when the temperatures plunged to zero and below. The leap forward is due to inverter technology, an engineering development that you deserve to know about. Millions of interested folks have gotten the word recently about inverter technology that changed everything in heat pump application and reliability at temperatures well below zero. This video will tell homeowners like you about the savings, efficiency, and reliability available by switching away from gas and propane furnaces to next generation heating and cooling systems. Heat pumps have always outperformed traditional gas furnaces in two meaningful ways, efficiency and versatility. But HVAC professionals knew that heat pumps began to lose efficiency and heating power somewhere around 25 degrees Fahrenheit, gradually becoming useless as temperatures approach zero. This led to large parts of the country using gas or propane furnaces for primary heating. These systems did allow some folks to stay warm at moderate gas costs, but those rural customers were forced to pay the high price of filling their propane tanks several times a year. With next generation heat pumps, the technology at the heart of the system is the variable speed inverter. This means that today's heat pumps are the most efficient and affordable way to heat homes anywhere on the planet. When you run a single stage air conditioner or furnace, it cycles between on and off. Each system may turn on for a length of time, but when the home has been sufficiently cooled or heated, it turns itself off again. As the air gradually returns to the set match point, it turns back on again. This is like always driving your car at 100 miles an hour, not very efficient or smart. An inverter-driven variable speed compressor allows your heat pump to operate within the full range between zero and 100%. It does this by analyzing the temperature and conditions inside the home and then adjusts its output to maximize efficiency and comfort. Because of the design and engineering behind the compressors and coils, as well as a wide range of variable speed operation, heat pumps can still heat your home well below zero with more than twice the efficiency of gas heating or standard electric heating, such as electric furnaces or baseboard heaters. They've been tested and approved as far north as the Arctic Circle and are popular options in the very cold countries like Finland and Norway. The best part about these pumps? They can cool in the summertime also, a true heating and cooling system. Customers that previously filled their costly propane tank several times a year can finally rejoice and say, no more propane. Stay warm in the winter and cool in the summer, all while keeping your money in your pocket. The process of converting from a gas or propane furnace to a next generation heating and cooling system generally goes like this. First, your HVAC tech verifies your home's size and BTU needs and buys the new equipment. Then they remove the old AC condenser and the indoor gas furnace and AC coil capping off the gas lines. Next, the tech or an electrician will install the necessary electrical wiring to provide power to the new units, both outdoor and indoor. This is probably the hardest part of the install because the gas furnace didn't require much electricity since it burned gas. Next, the outdoor condenser unit is set into place and the refrigerant lines are run. Then, the indoor air handler and coil are installed and connected to the existing ductwork system, along with the condensation discharge hose. After all the connections are made, the refrigerant lines are purged and charged. A suitable location is found for the thermostat and all the electrical wiring is connected. It's time to power up the new heating and cooling system and finally get rid of that propane tank. Make the switch from a gas or propane furnace to a next generation heating and cooling system. It really is just that simple.